Man, what's good with y'all? It's your boy AYB, man. We backing up the video. Today I'm doing like an R&B type of thing. You know, it's my first time doing this on the channel. So we're going to try something new. It's like an R&B, you know, Roddy Rich, DJ Muscle type of thing. So I'm going to clip it up, show y'all how I did it, break it down. And you know, we're going to see what happens. Like, comment, subscribe, you know. See anything in the video you're interested in, sign up for my Patreon. Link in the description. Let's get into it, man. Pipe it up game, man. All right, y'all. So... I start off with this guitar, Contact, Evolution Jazz, shout out Alec, you know, you put me on game with this joint with the last video. I start off with the D, the F, A sharp, then the A, and then I did it as if I was playing on the guitar, so I, I used the D minor chord, and did it as if it was drumming, so let me put the helpers on so you can actually see what I mean. So you see how all the notes are on the ghost spots because it's a part of the D minor chord. And I put the G in between just to fill out the chord. And I went up to the F, then I bring it down with the C, A, then the G, then the A sharp, then the D, then the F, then the G. Then the A is kind of like a diminished chord. Then I add the top notes. Just to add the spice to it, I added the a, the G, the C, the G. I'm gonna play it for y'all. Then we saw with the guitar to make it actually sound good. And with the guitar rig, added the preset. I think it's the Twang Jazz. No, I'm sorry. It's the Jazz Amp Mono Stereo. I added that. I'm going to turn that on. See, it sounds totally different. I added the Valhalla Reverb. Just to give it a little reverb. the effect rack double wide doubler also the EQ to take out the low end then after that I added Omnisphere piano I took the top notes I just added notes to play on top of the guitar I'm gonna play it by itself I'm gonna play them both together After that, you know, I got to add a little IK chop in there. I did I added the piped up bass man from the drum kit coming song man you already know D I just really basically just copy it with the the root notes of the piano like the bass notes it has to be on Then after that, I added a piano, but basically, all right, so I had the piano 
but I took it out because you know CPU man put money into the computer man just don't act, act stupid sometimes so I had to put it on, on the piano I'm gonna copy matter of fact yeah let me copy and paste it on and see what you sound like on the piano so really for every melody I added this You know, there's like this little kind of transition to the next measure. So when all the melodies play together, it'll play in sync. And that kind of be like a top melody for the artist to you know, like sing on it. But the crazy part about this melody is when I was making it, I accidentally put it in the same channel as the guitar. So it made this crazy effect. And I was like, yeah, I got to keep it like this. So I'm going to play it by itself. I made it an audio output. So I'm play everything together. It's not 100% a Roddy Rich type of thing, but you know, Roddy Rich, he he's really done like songs on any kind of beat, so it's like you never know. It just basically just all vibe, just the soul, just R&B vibes, just melodic, just you know, you can feel in your chest. You know, your girl break your heart, you got you, you feel me? Did you don't hit you? I think that's it for each melody. I don't think, yeah. I, you know, I added a drum loop as well. I don't think I put any effects on it. Yeah, I did. I just put an EQ just to make the sound underwater, and the reverb, and the delay, and the RC20. You know, a little something. Let's get into the drums. So I put everything down. This hi hat from my drum kit to be announced. Let me see what I put down. So with this, I just took the note. Highlighted it, then Alt U. You know, just play with the knob. You really do it however you want to do it. Just to slice the notes up. You don't gotta, you know, overthink it too much. And for this part right here, I try to do it like how the hats were like on the box. How 30 Rock did it. Dang, I can't get it right. All right, so you put it on one third. Just fill it in every little small spot. Like I know with their beat, like it was every other. I had was like this, but we're not doing exactly like you still got to be your own person. And I bring it down, bring one down, and just slice it right here just to add it, just to add a little bounce to it. All right, so we're gonna go to the clap, also the pipe up clap. I bring this snare. Kept everything the same kind of stuff in the end. I changed it up right here. You know, it's kind of like a, the R&B snare. I hear like in a lot of like songs like Jeremiah, Todd Dallas saying. And I put two rims. It's one of my favorite rims. Because it's kind of like a rim and a perk together. For real, for real. 
But I'm gonna play those together. Now, at the open hi-hat. I tried to play the open hi-hat like a, uh, a crash on a drum set just to help you, you know, with the bounce a little bit when you're feeling in. Last perk I use, you know, mustard got the bell. And last, but not, I think it's the last. Oh, we got the 808 in my piped up 808 from the jump kit, man. So basically. When you're doing 808s and you cannot think about what to do. And with melodies like this, I'm telling you, all you have to do is follow the bass notes. Well, I'll use the piano, for example. All you have to do is use the bass notes if you do not know where to put your 808. Now you can, or you can just use, you feel me? Anything on the scale, man. You not stretch yourself out and use use your coming resource. You gotta work smarter, not harder, man. Gotta use the cheat code sometime, man. Like it's you know like GTA, same address. All right, so I'm put got the 808. You know I do the the one half of two, the six. You know that's just the basic. Yeah, I'm gonna be put it to E. With my kicks, I don't put it on every hit. I just, you know, play around with it. I think, yeah, that's it for the drums. So I'm going to put everything out, and then, you know, we're going to play it from the top. All right, so I got everything out. We're going to see what it sounds like. So there you go, man. I appreciate y'all tuning in, you know. Happy Friday, man. Make sure you're being productive, man. Stay safe. Running money up, man. Get out the bed. Get to work. 2021, man. We want all the plaques. We want all the number ones. We want, you feel me? We want everything. Man, y'all have a good day, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man. If you see anything on the video, you know, Patreon link in the description, man. Come chop it up with me. All right, I'm out the jump.